Let's get salty! Hey everyone, Zeddy here again today with a brand new video to we wait like a balance patch or, you know, update to the weekly quest thing. I wanted to go over one of Hearthstone's only unsolved mysteries. This card back, the Labyrinth card back, emerged with the latest expansions patch being put into the game. One of Celeste Delon's diabolical hidden card back set. It's been over a month and it is yet to be solved. And maybe just maybe one of you can help us solve it as there's only one piece missing in the puzzle. We're gonna go over all the different steps that have been discovered, completed, and which is left to unlock this really cool card back that I think a lot of us would have. And plus there's just a lot of cool mini games like associated with this whole journey. And if you enjoy the content on the channel, if you like I've earned your subscription, please hit that sub button down below. Give the video a like, it helps us out a lot. So if you're unaware, if you head towards the achievement tab, I can never remember which one it is, despite the fact I'm an achievement honor with only almost 55, 5,000 points, you head over to gameplay all the way down to the general section. There were some achievements added pretty recently to unlock this car back, which again, we are one step away from completing, which gives you that labyrinth card back. All of these achievements and uh, their solutions and the data and everything to go along with it has been done by the WoW Secret Discord, which I'll be referring to later on in the video as well. But it's over here where they're basically have discussed and investigated together to solve all this stuff. There's associated pin message and documents. It'll all be linked down below, but this is the group that we're gonna hopefully try be able to work for and figure out this one unsolved mystery. But yeah, let's dig into what everything is doing. There's basically four things that need to be solved and three of them have been. The first one, say my name, has been solved. It actually showed up as a tavern brawl, so very likely completed it. But if you haven't, to complete this achievement, it's pretty darn simple. You wanna head over to the Hearthstone menu. You wanna click the X or the question mark down here to go to the tutorial. You wanna go where there's a five and a two, and you click this button up here here and it loads a guessing mini game similar to like rards like do you know hearthstone guessing the card name again if you played that tavern brawl you know it and it's available in the game whenever you want to play it and basically just guess the card names correctly and you will complete this so we have a comma is a comma over here we got ourselves in a comma we have armored goon is armored goon out here i actually can't even recall what the heck that card is so we can come back to that a new bar a new bar ambusher is this guy over here. We have Kane Sun Fury is not on the board. Reflecto Engineer is right there. We have Photographer Fizzle does not appear to be uh, participating right now. Neither is Lightseed, but we got Direhorn right here. We have Corpse Bride right here. So basically just find the names do all that good stuff. You can always try to look it up if you don't know. And if you get it wrong, it will restart. But overall, I, I've, I've played this game a few too many times. So I kind of know, or typically know, I don't want to screw this up, which all the cards are. Remember Ice Revenant was nerfed at one point? That was, uh, that was like, where's my Fierce Monkey? I want my Fierce Monkey. There's some uh, Noble Minibot. I think that's like a Baron Scavenger or something. And then we got the old Togwoggle here. High Spear Togwoggle. You complete it the one time that first step is done. So that was solved by the achievement hunters and all that. You would get some XP. It was a way to like get event XP when they changed that whole system to be more annoying. Oh yeah, the things they keep micromanaging. So that achievement out of the way. Next one was called this or that and the hint of like the most powerful war ban. And to complete that one, you actually have to go into the options. You then go into miscellaneous. You then go into the credits. Once the credits load, you have to click like down on the bottom left, like right Right around here and another mini game appears and this one you just have to do one simple thing a lot of times so as it loads up you just have to guess which the oldest card is the older card is the correct answer and you can kind of tell by the expansion symbols here and you have to do it like 40 times get it correct that many times you can you'll see like mana differences the mana can be different the numbers you can just ignore that it is purely about what the older card 
is. So I believe this is Festival of Legends. I think this was like the mini set. I actually think this is the older one, Grime Walker. I'm not sure. But again, I'm not going to go through this whole thing because it's pretty long. We're just going to rip through and I'll just quickly guess what I think the older card is. And basically, you get it off right, you will destroy the enemy hero. So we'll just quick through high, like we'll fast forward and you'll see what the end looks like. So you can see, do we get there? I, I, I tried my best. We're three off, but yeah, you try that. Once you get it down to low, I think you have to restart the entire thing. But yeah, you complete that, you will then get that part of the achievement done. The last one that has been solved was one of the most difficult we've ever had to complete. Crazy eights, eight turns, eight winners. This one is going to be a challenge for anybody to beat because it requires you to start a Battlegrounds game with seven other people and then passing, doing nothing, literally clicking nothing for I think the first two turns or three turns. And then after that, a mini game will emerge for all of you where you have like light spawn elementals and you have to match up the stats with your opponent perfectly, but you won't be able to see what they have. So you have to like communicate either in game or like I did with my viewers. We did this like a month ago in Discord in a voice chat. Again, I'll refer to the uh, Secret Finding Discord it has been researching and trying to figure all this stuff out. You can coordinate groups there. There's a lot of really friendly, nice people um, that you could try and do that with. But this is by far the most difficult one to complete because it requires it like straight up seven other people or you have to somehow have like seven other accounts all running at the same time and you're working with yourself. It is pretty difficult and uh, kind of unfortunate out of all the achievements, this is the only one ever you needed another person and like multiple people to complete. So um, yeah, good luck on that one. And that leaves us with the last unsolved achievement. This one here, what a long strange trip it's been. Where can you find in what's been found? And for like over a month, we couldn't even find the entrance to this puzzle or anything like that but it was discovered that during the same my name mini game the same minions would sometimes appear twice there's actually 40 of them and if you make a deck out of those 40 cards it looks a lot like this it's like a renathal weird ass murloc whatever deck just random cards it's very free to play accessible i think they're mostly free cards the etc it doesn't matter what's in there and basically you take this deck which will be linked uh, in the description below. You go to wild, queue up this deck, hit the play button, it will load another mini game. And this is the last and final puzzle that the uh, secret discord has found, has found the entrance to, and it's been a week or two since they have found this. Don't know how to solve it. There's only certain things that you can only attack into another minion. And basically no matter what, if you attack in, it resets. So there's no indicator of what's right or wrong. Uh, the base health for the minions is always correct on the, like Yeti has five health, Chogol has eight health, but the attack values seem to be kind of random. They're always larger and we haven't been able to figure it out. So this is the unsolved mystery of what attack patterns need to be had. So the WoW secret discord, I will link down in the description below. In this discord, there's the Hearthstone secret section and they have been working on it. They've been trying to figure it out, how to complete it. And it was noted pretty recently from Celestial on the maker of it that he thinks they made significant progress earlier. You just haven't been down that path since as far as I've seen. So you can see the deck string and kind of the progress they made. There's like the, the Google doc that has all the details of all these achievements, how they got to this place. So again, wanted to shout them out if you want to try and help them solve this mystery so we can post that solution, get that card back, as well as you can complete those other achievements, including the B 
RPGs ones, you know, if you could find some people, but it's also just a great place. You go to that Discord, uh, people try and get like secret finding topics, try and work together, get that done. So shouting them out and hopefully we can solve this mystery together. Anyways, if you enjoyed the video, please like and subscribe. Have a great day and stay salty, my friends.